In the new ORMC tower, two floors are dedicated to intensive care units. Here on level four, we treat patients in need of neurology and trauma care. The ICU patient rooms were designed with critical care in mind. Each room features wider doors to accommodate a variety of equipment and machines. There are windows in the doors so we can have better visibility of the patients. And the rooms also include private bathrooms, a sofa for visitors, flat screen TV, and built-in linen hamper. There's also a built-in supply closet just outside each room, which offers added convenience. Each patient room also features a wall-mounted computer that allows caregivers, like me, to work on a patient's chart more quickly and efficiently, giving us instant access to important patient information at all times. When patients need to be moved for testing, a portable monitor goes with them and syncs to the main room monitor. This provides nurses and doctors with continuous monitoring of vital signs such as blood pressure and heart rate, even while the patient is being transported. Select rooms on each floor are equipped with a mechanical lift device that can lift a patient from the bed and a ceiling track that can safely guide the patient from the bed to the bathroom. This provides a much safer way for patients who are weak or unstable to be able to use the restroom and maintain some independence and privacy. It also helps prevent the risk of injury to patients and caregivers. Both floors that treat ICU patients in the new tower are connected to the existing facility through private corridors. These corridors make it easier to safely move even the sickest patients to services, such as surgery and radiology, without the use of elevators. When we built the new tower, we paid special attention to the needs of our patients' families. Each floor features calming retreat spaces, soothing waiting areas, and private rooms for patient and family consultations. 